Several years ago, I traveled to South Africa. And I went to a side in South Africa called Durban. And I started a church there. I bought instrument, bought everything, and gave it to a pastor. I'm, hear me? And that is over. Champions. And I relocated him from this country down there. He's not a pastor you might know. And he was there in Durban. I was doing very, very well. I was paying him, supporting him. I spent some good millions. He just woke up one morning, sent me a text, abused me, said all manner of things, and took over the church, changed the name, did everything. I kept quiet. I did not say one word. I did not even think about it. <laughs> because I, they didn't buy me with any car or any material. Why should I run after anything? As long as you want to go. As long as you are not taking my life, you are taking property, material. I've never said this. I kept quiet. And then, the wife came here. We were in the old side and said, I have been having dreams. Angels are appearing to me, telling me to talk to my husband that he should return everything that belongs to this ministry back to you. If not, they will take him home before time. I told her, I said, woman of God, or oh, my daughter, I'm not praying against your husband, no. She said, I know, Papa, in my dreams, I saw how quiet you are. And the angel said to me, your quietness is dangerous. And I said, I'm quiet. She, she called her husband in my presence and said, I'm with Papa. And he picked them and said, no. Uh, if you are with Papa, so what? I have told you, you should not go there. I was hearing him talk. And I said, look, my daughter, I didn't invite you here. You came. I don't want anything to happen to your marriage. Go back. Let me cut the long story short. I'm not giving this testimony to spite anybody. The car that was the car of the ministry, everything that was everything about the ministry. Everything. In that car that he took, he had an accident and died masslessly. Everything that he took from the ministry was looted by another person carried away. Maybe they have hit you on every side and you cannot reply. Can I pray this prayer? Those who are fighting you and you think God is quiet, the Lord will fight your battle for you.